Thanks for the hearts. Sorry if you see my finger going across the screen. I'm getting like tons of Instagram notifications right now. <laughs> okay. So these are the props I'm going to be doing. I'm not sure how to work this new camera thing here on Periscope. So let me turn the light up. That's better. Hello. So these are the pops we're gonna do. Hopefully my chocolate didn't set already. Because <laughs> I was just sitting here trying to figure out if I was actually gonna do Periscope or not. I am 30. I'm old. <laughs> I might have to remelt my chocolate. Let's see. <clears throat> okay, well this is the pop that I have here. Thanks, everybody thinks I'm 20, so I guess that'll work out for me in the long run. <laughs> so these are my pops. And then these are the little um, paint palettes that I did. This order is actually going out tomorrow, so I'm a little behind. <laughs> but this is just fondant, and the different colors are the uh, candy writers. <clears throat> So I'm just going to show you guys how I put these. Um, these are chocolate cake pops. I have a few other things to go with this order, so I'm going to be back on maybe later or tomorrow, depending on how quickly I get things done. <laughs> so, as you can see, I made a little hole in there for the cake pop stick. And I just have some melted dark chocolate, which is the same color as the pop here. Hopefully, it'll come out of here. Okay. <clears throat> so I'm just putting a little bit of... Uh, oh, cool. <laughs> Don't stalk me or anything, but that's cool. <laughs> so I'm going to put a little melted chocolate there. And then I'm just going to stick it to the stick here. <clears throat> My lighting is horrible, so sorry. <laughs> I'm just going to hold it until it kind of sets a little bit because <clears throat> I want this all to go into the bag so that's why it's kind of close to the, the pop there. Okay, so then I'm just going to set that aside, kind of let it set and I have five more like this. <laughs> Oh, and if my mother comes downstairs, she's going to think I'm talking to myself, but I'm not, so it's okay. I probably need to remelt my chocolate, but we're going to attempt to finish this. I should have been more prepared. I'm sorry to the ten people that are watching me right now. <laughs> Let's see, I do have other chocolate that I did for the tops. Let's see if I can use one of those. <clears throat> there we go. I haven't been on Periscope for a while, so excuse my rustiness here. <clears throat> Thank you. The person that ordered it, she uh, actually sent me a picture from Pinterest that had the little palette on there. And she said, well, it's not necessary to have it, but I like to go over the top. So I just figured I'd throw it in there. It's usually an extra charge to do, like, fondant work and things like that. But I just needed to make it more for her event. I believe it's for a birthday and they're doing the um, the wine and painting class so that's gonna be a cute little set and then if I decide to come on later you guys will see the new the um, the other pops that she's getting she's actually getting the handle part is gonna be a paintbrush kind of like this one so they're just gonna be sticking up in there and then I'm gonna do like some paint splatter and things like that on there so it's going to be a cute little set, and I will show uh, the pictures of it, you know, on my Instagram and everything. So, if you guys want to check that out, I will be giving you the 
links to my social media pages <clears throat> once I'm done doing this. So everything sets pretty quickly. Obviously it's chocolate and it's a little chilly in my house. Um, we tend to keep the air on year round so it's setting a lot quicker which is good. Good and bad at the same time <laughs> because it's good that you know I can get it to set faster but it's bad because it's setting too quickly and I was trying to you know get my periscope all set up with the title and stuff and my chocolate is slowly <laughs> setting up and drying out on me <clears throat> so this is the most tedious part is just putting the little pellets on there but after this I'll show you guys how I dip down to get the little uh, paint splatter thing on there so I just got one more after this so hopefully you're not too bored out of your mind <laughs> I need to get on Periscope more but I work for Apple so we had long two weeks mandatory 50 hour weeks especially with the new phones and things coming out so me and Periscope have not been friends for a while <laughs> Just no time, but I have tons and tons and tons of Halloween orders and things like that. Yeah, it is a lot of hours. <laughs> Luckily, though, I work at home, so it's not too bad. <clears throat> and I, I did that mainly because of the cake business and trying to have my own life outside of working for somebody else. So... Our mandatory hours are over as of last week, so this week I go back to my regular 40, and I'm actually looking forward to it. <laughs> okay, last one. Okay, and then I'm going to just go back to that first one that I showed you and show you how I make the little paint dripping effect on there. Come on chocolate. Okay, there we go. So that one is set. Here I'll show you all of them. <clears throat> My phone is plugged in, so I'm trying to get a good image of them. And excuse the messy kitchen back there. I'm actually working on the cake and cookies as well. <laughs> so Alright, so to get the little paint dripping effect that I have going on here, I have these wonderful cups. I got this from Big Lots. I mentioned it last time on my Periscope, but again, that was like maybe a month ago. <laughs> so these come with little um, tops, and you can put them, it's actually a soup cup, and you can put it in the microwave and melt your chocolate that way. Um, as far as chocolate, this is actually Wilton, which I think sucks because it clumps up and all of that. But um, the chocolate for my pops and the chocolate that I'm going to be using on later orders after this are all going to be Jatards um, because theirs is much, much better. <clears throat> anyway, so I have this little cup here. And again, this is the Wilton. It is a little bit thick right now because, like I said, it's just been sitting here. It might actually make the effect a little bit better. We'll see. But anyway, I just dip it straight in. Kind of twirl it around. And then knock off the excess. And then before too much of it is gone, <clears throat> I turn it right side up. And then just kind of shake it to kind of get the dripping. And again, I might have to remelt before... It gets all weird looking. Let's see. I also have blue as well. <clears throat> and I think this might this might be even more set than that one. Yeah, I have to go and remelt. So give me 15 seconds and I will be right back.
I know I probably lost some people. It's okay. I had to remelt. So it gets a little bit better. Um, so it might work out a bit better. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, so this is going to be the last green one actually. Because I'm doing six green and six blue. Okay, so then you knock off the excess. little drips and then because I put the little bristle brush marks in there I think what I'm gonna do is actually re-dip them um, in the green because this is the very first one that I did and you can still kind of see the brush marks at the top there and I don't know if I want that effect or not so we're gonna re-dip and see which way looks better looks too thick to me so I guess I'll leave it alone <laughs> save myself some time okay and now for the blue ones I try not to make my scopes very long mainly because I put them on my YouTube page afterwards and I just don't have all day to sit and talk to you fine people <laughs> even though I would love to one day when I have my just my business for myself <laughs> and not have to worry about breaks and lunches and stuff there's the drip we're looking for my YouTube page actually let me go ahead and show you guys my list of social media <laughs> because I have pretty much everything but the one thing I forgot to put on this list is YouTube so that's gonna be at the bottom <clears throat> okay, so this is my oh, let me just take you out of the out of the charger first and out of the tripod. Okay, I can't see. <laughs> If you can see. Uh, let me try turning it. There we go. That's better. So this is my social media. I'll leave it here for a moment. And I'm sorry if I'm super loud now, but it's super close to my face. <laughs> so as you can see, I have literally every social media. And I couldn't remember my Google Plus, so that's missing off of here. But everything else is accurate. I didn't put my Etsy page and all of that because you can find that information in my um, what is it summaries or descriptions or whatever they call it. So that's all my social media. I do have a store where I sell um, <clears throat> molds and straws and cake pop stuff and cookie stuff and a bunch of stuff so <laughs> if you ever wanted to order anything from me I do also ship um, cupcakes cookies cake pops I don't ship cakes yet so that um, hi Sabrina I'm Sabrina too <laughs> and I'm following you I think and I was like hey we have the same name <laughs> I have only met like three other Sabrinas okay so that's that so you guys should be all set. I'm sorry I'm watching Teen Titans go. <laughs> so let me put you back in here and then I'll flip you around. I love this little tripod, but it's so hard to like get it together. <laughs> See now it wants to fall over. Hold on. <laughs> I have to figure it out again. Okay, now I think I'm gonna be okay. No, we good. Am I upside down? I don't know. I can't tell. Okay, I think we're good. Anyway, so 
that's my social media stuff. So if you want to follow me or stalk me or anything, feel free. Because um, I have no life outside of Apple. <laughs> okay. And then after this, I only got two more. And then I have to do her other pops. And me and this lady went back and forth, back and forth on Etsy. Like, what do you want? What do you want? <laughs> And I'm glad she actually came up with this idea. And I also, um, I'll grab them out of the freezer for you before I get off of here. Um, she actually ordered some push pops from me as well. In like a rainbow theme. So, I'll show those to you too. <clears throat> I didn't do a scope on that because it was super time consuming. <laughs> Right, last one. Oh, it might be my connection if it freezes up on you. Our AT&T U-verse is just like every day we have a problem. <laughs> Literally every day. So, it's probably me. Let me walk you over to the, oh, let me show you these. Then I'll walk you over to the freezer so you guys can see my, uh, my push. Excuse my super dirty kitchen. These are the cookies that I'm doing for my best friend's birthday. They are lemon lavender, so I colored them purple. I'm going to try and do like a, uh, the painted box where she does like the watercolors because that is just so pretty to me. These are the push props that I did. This one is not the best looking one, <laughs> but um, it's just vanilla cake. No, 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 I in here. It's just vanilla cake with, um, oh, here's the pretty one. I found it in the freezer. Just vanilla cake with uh, vanilla hybrid buttercream and just little confetti sprinkles on the top. So I have them freezing, so that way when I go to ship them tomorrow, they're not all crazy. Because our freezer was tons of food for no reason. <laughs> but, um, sorry if I'm moving around too much now. I'm like, what do I have to do next? So I'm probably going to come on later and show you guys the other um, cake pops that she's getting with the... Uh, the paint brushes instead of the sticks they should be cute so thanks for the hearts i'm gonna go um let these dry package them up and then um i'll be back i'll say probably i'm gonna shoot for 8 30 eastern <laughs> so we shall see time always eludes me so it might be later it might be earlier just depends on when I get too tired. <laughs> so, those are my little paint brushes. Let's get in better light. And I know my house looks crazy, disgusting, but it's not. <laughs> it's just my little area. I don't know if I like this one. I think I need to redip it because it doesn't have a drip. I'm very OCD about things. <laughs> hey, Toxic Sweet Shop. Thanks for inviting people, but I'm about to go now. <laughs> These are my little pops. I guess I'll stay for a few seconds and let people see them. Hey Joyce, I saw you liked my Facebook page. Thanks. <laughs> so now we're like friends in real life. <laughs> and I actually went out and bought my little... Uh, giant cupcake pan too i'm like excited i kind of want to show you what i'm going to do i might actually facebook message you and show you what i'm going to do yeah they can rewatch 24 hours and i'll put it on facebook too i mean not facebook uh youtube <laughs> yeah i figured i was like i'm gonna be interrupting somebody else's scope and i don't know how that works i don't know the rules of <laughs> of uh periscope yet so <laughs> Yes, I will Facebook you the picture of what I want to do. All 
all right but i'm gonna go i'll be back in like an hour hour and a half i have to clean this mess <laughs> oh again with my social media for the new people i have never had 22 people on a periscope so thanks <laughs> i'm gonna guess that's all toxic sweet shop there's me if you need to find me for anything you can message me, stalk me, just don't come to my house or anything. <laughs> I live in the boondocks anyway, so sorry if I'm shaking. <clears throat> Alright, I'm gonna go. I'll be back in like an hour, hour and a half. See you guys later. Thanks for coming, everybody that uh, Toxic Sweet Shop invited. That's cool. Okay, I'll see you guys later. If I if I learn how to stop the broadcast, I'll see you later. <laughs>